Hi everyone, I'm Mary with Mary Greeley News. Thank you for joining me. There was a magnitude 6.6 .6 earthquake off the coast of Crete, Greece in the Mediterranean Sea. There was a brief tsunami warning. Originally it was only about 7 inches high. I guess when it reached land it was about an inch high. 19 people reported feeling this earthquake. And so far there has not been any reports of damage. Earthquakes in this area are common because of the subduction. We got a subduction zone, an arch here, uh, because of the African plate diving underneath the Eurasian plate. There is a blocked zone as these uh, two continents collide. And here on Google Earth, I put the direction of the movement of uh, Crete, Greece. It's moving um, south where the African plate is moving north. Because of the location of this blocked zone, we had uplift. Here we have the moment tensor ball on geoscope. You can see how um, before and during the earthquake, how we got uplift going on. There is also a research paper that has a great example of what's going on. Over here we have Africa. Here we have Greek, Crete, Greece. You can see we got the uh, African um, plate diving underneath Greece, Crete, Greece. And this was like 5 million years ago, present day. And you can see this locked zone, this block of locked zone, and where it is currently. Let me pull this down for you so you can see the other half. This is what they're expecting in the future. A Twitter post about the original tsunami said it was a very dangerous um, tsunami uh, zone where they could have lots of tsunamis because of this collision between the continents. So originally the tsunami was 20 centimeters or 7.9 inches. And they got an image here with their post. I am surprised that there was only, well maybe I shouldn't be surprised, only 19 people reported feeling this earthquake on USGS but it was felt as far away as Israel. There has been a few aftershocks since this earthquake. There was also a 5.4, 17.2 kilometers in depth, a 4.7, 10 kilometers in depth, and then another 4.7. This one here was prior, maybe you could call it a foreshock, before the 6.6 .6 was a 4.3 and was 43.4 kilometers in depth. Like I said, we got the colliding of the continents here, and the continents are showing movement around the world, an increase in this movement. Evidently, most of the reports that came from Israel, which is, let me bring this out, over here, those that did report feeling the earthquake supposedly were along the coast. If that's the case, I'm sure there in Cyprus they felt this earthquake too. The reports on EMSC said it was light movement, uh, shook for about one minute, big duration, but the feeling was of a lesser grade. This is the first tsunami warning for the area, but only from this site could this be possible. There is some translation here. It says too much shaking. Um, another one says gentle, intense oscillation, long duration. Swaying motion without sound that lasted for at least a minute. Light movement of hanging objects in-house. Very light. Now these are 136 to 137 kilometers from where it occurred. So that's about 84, 85 miles from the location of the earthquake. Uh, long lasting and quite strong. Everything moving for about a minute. Um, we got another one here. Very strong vibration. Quiet and long-lasting, no worries in the area. So I doubt if there was damage. Very strong and long-lasting. Maybe, you know, things falling off the, the walls. There might be some cracks. I would not be some cracks. A joggle, it says here. Uh, long enough, yeah, if it shakes for a minute. Long duration, swing. Um, that one is not translated. These other ones are not being translated. This one here says short with slow shift. 
uh, lasted quite long, strong enough to feel it, no damage in my house. Now that was 142 kilometers, so that's about 87, 88 miles. Um, sensitive, not very intense, long lasting. Well, if we were in the epicenter, we would have lots of trouble. But luckily, again, for the epicenter was not in the island. It was far away from Crete Island. Small tsunami is normal for North Crete right now. Stay away from the beach for the next two hours. So that's all I have about that. I don't have any images of damage or reports of power outage and things like that, thank God. But, yep, things are happening around the world. What are your thoughts? Put your comments down below. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for watching. Thank you for your support. Please stay safe, and I will talk to you later. God bless you. Bye.